जी असलकम क्या हाल चाल है आपकी उम्मीद है सब खैरियत से होंगे सो वेलकम टू माई चैनल मैथमेटिकल रूम सो इन अवर टू डेज वीडियो दैट वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व द लीनियर फ्रैक्शनल इक्वेशन एज यू नो वी हैव स्टार्टेड द सीरीज ऑफ टू सॉल्व द लीनियर इक्वेशंस सो लीनियर इक्वेशंस are kind of different uh, can be a different kind of equations that uh, we have already learnt uh, in our last two three lectures that uh, how can we solve the linear equations so this is also a series of uh, these equations that uh, we are going to learn that how can we solve the linear equation when it is uh, given in fractional form so as you can see <coughs> that i have written an equation uh, in one variable that is x with uh, some fractions you can see in the equation so first of all we have to remove these fractions and you can say that denominators should be removed that uh, can make the equation easy to solve so <coughs> first of all we are going to remove these denominators as you know that the method to remove the denominators is to take the lcm and then multiply the whole equation on both sides with the lcm so if you see the in denominators the numbers are 6 2 and 4 so when you take the lcm of 6 2 and 4 so that becomes 12 i i can show you that how you can take the lcm of these numbers so we got the numbers in the equation 2 4 and 6 so find the number that can divide these three numbers so 2 is the number that can divide these three numbers so 2 ones are 2 2 twos are and 2 threes are <coughs> so again that can be divided by 2 so 1 you can write as it is and then 2 ones are 2 and 3 as it is so now divide the three number 1 1 and 3 ones are 3 so 3 twos are 6 and 6 twos are 12 so 12 is the lcm that you can find in this way and now we are going to multiply the whole equation by 12 <coughs> <coughs> so now that equation can be written like 12 multiply by x plus 7 divided by 6 plus 12 multiply by 1 over 2 is equal to 12 multiply by x minus 2 over 4 so now divide them to so 6 ones are 6 and 6 twos are 12 2 ones are 2 and 2 six are 12 and 4 ones are 4 and 4 threes are 12 now <coughs> if you see that we have removed these denominators from the equation so <coughs> now multiply 2 with this equation so that equation will become 2x plus 2 sevens are 14 that too will be multiplied with these two terms so plus 6 ones are 6 is equals to 3 will multiply with these two terms so 3x multiplied by 3 multiplied by x will become 3x minus 3 twos are 6 so now if you see <coughs> the equation has become in the in 
its simplest form that 2x plus 14 plus 6 is equal to 3x minus 6. So now take the x variables on one side and the constants on one side. So if you take the 3x from this side to that side, so this 3x is positive on this side when you take the other side, so that will become negative. So 2x minus <coughs> 3x and that 14 and 6 will become 20 and this minus 6 will be there and now take the 2 20 from this side to other side and subtract them to 2x minus 3x so when you subtract subtract a bigger amount from smaller amount so that will become with that negative sign so the those two terms will be subtracted but the sign will be negative so 3 minus 2 becomes 1 so x means 1x that means x so now take the 20 from this side to the other side so minus 6 and positive 20 when goes on the other side will become, will become like minus 20. So now minus x is equal to minus 6 and minus 20 will be added with each other but the signs will be minus. So same signs, remember this thing that same signs always added with each other. <coughs> so that will become minus 26. So you can see the both, this equation has the negative sign on, on both sides. So that will be cancelled with each other. So the value of x will be x is equal to 26. So that's the way we can solve the linear equation. <coughs> or you can say linear fractional equation. And we can find the value of x, that x is equal to 26. So that's how we can simplify these kind of equations, linear equations, that <coughs> we can find the answer of, or we can find the value of x by solving these kind of things. So inshallah, <coughs> I will see you in my next video. Please do subscribe my channel. And uh, inshallah, I will see you in my next video. Tab tak ke liye jaldi bijiye. Allah Hafiz.